this is a serious, serious problem. Mm. I think everyone is a victim of this. Mm. I don't know who is going to shout it to us. I don't know whether it can be shouted or softly spoken. <laughs> Are you aware that when someone accepts a mystic, mm. that is the strongest human being yes. in this world? Mm. Wow. Accepting mm. that is the strongest human what would I say? Even not human, a husband and a wife. Yeah. And should That's be the pardoned. Strongest. They are not mm. weak. Mm. They shouldn't be they are blamed. The strongest. Wow. Mm. You are getting that because wow. immediately they accept, as we have said, mm. your mind and your heart will give you capacity never to go that way again. Yeah. Amen. But this person yeah. who is denying and giving excuses and trying person. to defend himself, mm. he is the person who is very, very, very weak. episodes are very important. These teachings are very important. We have. Because now it makes you know, oh, mm. I'm the one who is in charge of my life. Mm. That's what my the Bible space. says. Mm. Yeah, that's what the Bible says. You shall declare a thing. And Not sure. someone else who speaks yes. a thing. Yes. Mm. It is you it is declare you. a thing. You declare a thing and it is established. And it shall be established yeah. and you shall see the light in that path. Mm. So wow. if you, if, and you shall also see darkness mm. in the same path if you declared mm. darkness. Mm. We must separate people mm. from yourself. Mm -hmm. We should know that we, in this world God has given us a space. Mm. Every one of us, it doesn't matter how many billions we are. Mm. We have a space of our own. Mm. Yeah. And what controls that space mm. is your words mm. more than people's words. Mm. Wow. And that's why the word of God is clear mm. that a curse without a cause cannot stand. Mm. Because you might get people who are biased, people who hate mm. you for nothing. Mm. You know, people just want to curse you. Mm. But as long as you don't receive mm. it, mm. You, you rebel mm. against those negative words. Mm. They have no space in your space mm -hmm. unless you allow them yeah. that's very important i think what she has asked mm -hmm. is a very good question yes uh, about me i'm clean i was yes. raised up very well mm -hmm. you are not raised up very well when we meet yes. can you affect me it's about identity knowing who you are oh, yes there's someone who was saying that he was trying to rescue a crab from water that was trying to to, to sink mm -hmm. and every time he will try to hold it will bite him mm -hmm. so people are telling him why are you struggling to save this thing that is always biting you mm -hmm. he yes. said that my nature is to save and his nature is to bite so as much time to keep on biting me and keep on saving it mm -hmm. so i think we cannot now be influenced by that crab and the quick chopper now beating it because it's now saving it. that's what she was asking if i know my nature is to mm -hmm. to, to i was mm -hmm. raised well I can't be compromised by this person. Or I don't agree with these values yeah, yeah. or habits. Mm. Mm. So now on the same part of, of, of healing in terms of infidelity, mm. now there are two types. I wanted to know if this is the same type, if all people are the same, mm. especially when I talk about women. For instance, there's a way by I'll cheat on my wife and then I'll tell her sorry, then that is it. Then there is one where I've seen that I cheat on her, I don't say sorry, I go and buy a car. I cheat on her, I don't say sorry, I take her to Italy. I cheat on her. So my, my way of apologizing... That is manipulation. It is by uh, so, so, her. And, and you find this, this lady is comfortable. As much as she'll take me again another destination. That is numbing pain. <laughs> yeah. So is it way of apologizing by just giving her gifts and maybe taking her to new places? Is it another way of apologizing? I think one of the th reasons why one would use things mm. as a sign to show that their partner, mm. uh, they are sorry for what they have done. Mm. Most of these things, most of these people are people who have, who have grown up, yes. you know, not learning how to speak out. Yeah, mm. so they, they, they are mm. they're action oriented. Mm. They are not words oriented. It's an upbringing. Okay. It's a default of upbringing. Mm. Probably what they were, they were brought up in a family where there was a lot of toxicity. Mm. And so they were not given a chance to express themselves. Yeah. Mm. So to them, if they want to say sorry, they have to do something to compensate that. Mm. It's just like the way, uh, until now, people mm. think that salvation is by works. Mm. They don't know that salvation oh. is by grace. <laughs> so if you do so something for thing, God, God will be happy with you. God will be happy with mm. you. Mm -hmm. So it's the same mentality mm -hmm. on the spiritual, you know, mm. who, 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 when, you, when you beat yourself, like during, uh, you know, Easter time, you are beaten up and you are, you, you are hung on that tree. Mm. That's a sign <laughs> to show that really, you, you, you are repented. The same pain you, you, you've partaken in the kingdom of God. You get that salvation by works mm. and salvation by grace. Mm. 
mm. and grace comes through faith. You mm. see that? Eh? Mm. So the same thing with this person is an upbringing mm. or a mindset that has been created over time mm. with with the people that he interacted with mm. or the person whom he has seen other friends do. Mm. That when you have a misunderstanding with your wife, mm. uh, you, you do something to say sorry. But does your wife understand that language? Mm. So these people need a mentor. Mm. Because mm. the person who will suffer most is the wife or the husband. Mm. Because they can also be vice versa. Mm. They, they may really suffer because for them they want words, m more words, much more as you do actions mm. that are consistent to show me that you have really changed. Mm. So it is, uh, it is. It, they need an intervention. Mm. They need someone who can come in, a marriage mentor, mm. who can be able to guide them and tell them no. Mm. I think what you are doing is good, but if you did this, this will bring more healing to your partner. Mm. And that's why we said one of the things when you deny mm. that you have a, a problem, mm. you see, the way the way God has uh, wired a human being, mm. the normal human being. Yes is that if you accept a mistake, mm. your mind and your heart gives you energy to overcome it. You are mm -hmm. self-contained. Wow, Acceptance. if you accept yes. a mistake, oh. that's the, way God the mind has wired and the energy empowers you powerful. to overcome it. Yeah, that's the way God has wired a mm. human being. Mm. Yeah, that if you accept, because he knows mm. that we have the fallen nature, yes. mm. the fallen nature to sin, mm. you get that, mm -hmm. and to death. Mm. So as long as I am caught by Pastor Bolene doing something, mm. and I, I accept mm. the mind, my mind, and when I talk, the mind is not mm. just a small faculty. Yeah. Mm. It is everything. Mm -hmm. Your mind, your emotions, your willpower, mm. and also your heart, your human spirit, mm. gives you such an energy. Mm. To in, overcome, to overcome mm. this temptation mm. and it might never be repeated again. Mm. But because we have not been well taught, mm. anytime I am caught mm. or I find myself into a situation you that defense. I feel it is against uh, you know, the vows that I made mm. and, I, and I deny, mm. the minute you deny, mm. the same yourself. mind mm. and the body gives you many avenues and dimensions on how to escape as you continue doing this thing. <laughs> mm. What? Mm. So being defensive wow. on the issue mm. keeps you doing it. Thank you keep you. repeating mm. the patterns. Yes. It's like defensive. you are protecting it. Mm. Mm. The mind now mm. and the, and your heart mm. gives you such an energy, such, such that it's like you become a professor. It's like you are trying to be a PhD to, to mm. escape, to deny you and know, you become more to tactic. Go against, you yes. become more, oh, you become more tactical. Mm. Wow. Oh, you get become more crafty. Ah. That's the way the fallen nature of a man is. Wow. The more you are challenged, mm -hmm. the more you become more creative mm -hmm. on the on the on the negative side. Mm -hmm. So you we, we need to and these things can only come when we are taught. You can even teach children to always own up to their mistakes. Yes, when you own up your mistake, mm -hmm. owning up is not just saying owning up. Mm -hmm. Your mind immediately when it is accepted mm -hmm. and your heart accepts that you have done it. So the That's beginning of healing is owning up. Mm -hmm. owning up. Yes. And, and I, I think... want to give an example of a mm -hmm. man of God. Mm -hmm. Look at this man. I keep wondering, why would God choose such a wicked person to become an apostle? Paul, of all other people. Surely. Paul, a murderer. A murderer. Mm. A person who killed Malicious. people. Who did malicious. He and he's so hunting Christians, not any other person. Mm. You mm. see that? He's hunting mm. men of God. Yeah, mm. but when Jesus appeared to him, mm. you know, mm. and the light showed upon him, he accepted. Mm. He told him, Lord, yes. what do you want mm. with me? Wow. And whatever instructions mm. he was given, mm. he adhered to that. Okay, Paul you never said that. that at, at, no, I didn't know they were your people. I, uh, he, didn't, he never defended himself. Never. Mm. Okay. He never even, he just said, Lord, mm. here, what do you want me? And whatever mm. the Lord gave him instructions, mm. he obeyed as though he has been obeying. Mm. You oh. know, his mind, mm. his heart gave him energy mm. to be able now to follow Christ wholeheartedly. Mm. You know, mm. and his mind was in it. Mm. And he's the greatest apostle until now, mm. even after over 2,000 years are mm. over. Mm. That's the way God has created a human being. Mm. And we need to teach our children so that they don't repeat the same mistake. Mm. When you are caught in a mistake, mm. that does not mean that you are weak. Mm. Actually, when you accept, you are strong. Mm -hmm. We need to undo that. Mm. That when you own up, when you take responsibility over something that you have done, you are actually the strongest. Mm. You are the strongest. It takes emotional yeah. strength. Because this thing you might never repeat it again. Mm. You're getting that. But mm. if you keep on denying, no, I was just chatting with him. We only, we were only kissing. Mm. We, we never had sex. Mm. You will find as long as you're defending it, you keep falling the same mistake. There is over nothing over between us. That's why you find most of the couples who mm. tell you, Pastor mm. Sue, we have been discussing this for the last over 10 years. Mm -hmm. Nothing else. The thing is that denial. 
No one he has he never accepted accept. Yeah. Even when a video he still says no, it is this lady who who came here. I mean, it is this man. <laughs> you want to blame other people. <laughs> yeah. And we need to understand um, that yeah. the Adamic nature is very selfish. Mm. It is me, myself, and I. Mm. So for you to undo the Adamic nature mm. so that you can live a real life, mm. you've got to accept the mistakes because we are, we can fall into mistake no matter who you are, mm. no matter your level in life. Otherwise, if you deny, mm. the next thing what happens, you get into anger. Mm -hmm. You become now because now you want to deny and you want you become now emotional outburst. You want to show people that really you are not that you want to defend yourself. That's why you find most of the people when they are caught in a mistake, mm -hmm. they have anger issues because you want to suppress the truth. You want to manipulate what Bentley had said. Mm -hmm. Manipulation. Mm -hmm. You want to look like you are the one who is right. The person who is questioning you mm -hmm. is wrong. Mm -hmm. So you keep on going back to the same thing. Mm -hmm. You're getting that. Eh? Yeah. Then the next stage that a person goes is bargaining. So the person who is cheated on, like yes. for example, if it's my husband mm. who, I have, who has gone out, I keep asking, mm. what is wrong with me? Mm. Bon, bon, I really prefer, even I want to know who is that lady that I slept with. So that I look at her and I look at myself <laughs> and wonder, well, what is in this girl that, that is not in me? me. <laughs> now you are in bargaining. Uh -huh. Bargaining. Bargaining. Mm. Yeah. Kwani, and then my husband will ask himself, Kwani, uh, my, 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 my joystick is not enough for my wife. Where did he go for this man? Who is big or who is small? <laughs> what was my wife looking for? Mm. So it, you begin now to bargain. Wow. Mm -hmm. Bargaining now mm. is like you are using evidence to beat yourself mm. up and you want to challenge yourself, where did I go wrong? Mm. Not knowing it's if not fidelity you. is a choice, mm -hmm. there is nothing like a mistake. There is nothing because you must have planned. You must have known where you're going to meet. Which hotel are you meeting? At what time? Mm -hmm. You get that? All that in me involves a lot of planning. Mm -hmm. And I know Mze Hayuko. Mm -hmm. There are things I have calculated. I know it's not around. Mm -hmm. And the other person has also calculated. Mm -hmm. So it, it, there's nothing like having an infidelity mm -hmm. by mistake. Mm -hmm. No. Mom, you said something powerful here. <laughs> yes. And I think wow. it's affecting most of us. Yes. You find that maybe... <coughs> You said that I cheat on her. Yeah. The first thing she'll ask, no, she'll not question, she'll question herself. Kwani, who is that lady first? She want to first see that lady mm. yes. and then find out who is this lady? Mm. Is she taller than me? Is she Good. browner than me? Mm. Is it the figure? Mm. And then she she'll be like, All I've done for you, you still do this for me. Mm. Thank you. So it, it's coming back to her blaming herself that why Mbona Mimi, yet not letting this man just carry the burden as the one who has done mistake. Thank you. You begin saying now it is you who has caused it. It's me. Uh, it's, you are innocent. You've not done Thank anything you. wrong. Now you are mm. getting it. You've not done anything wrong. No, it's it him. Reality, it mm. is not something that the other spouse has done wrong. Yes. Mm. Because if there was something wrong, why mm. did you not air it? Mm -hmm. Why did you not speak mm. it? Because mm. nobody is your mind reader. Mm. Mm. My husband cannot get into my mind and know mm. that I'm not getting sexually satisfied mm. and vice versa. Mm. So we need to communicate. So mm. why did I not communicate? How come mm. we can communicate all the all other things mm. apart from sexuality? No, mm. it is me who has a, a, a certain mindset, mm -hmm. and there is something I'm looking mm. for mm. that I feel is not in my partner. Mm. 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 Mama, and that thing is a myth; mm. it's not a reality. Mm. So yeah. if you even found in the infidelity, the problem is not Pastor Monene. Mm. It, it is, is you me who mm. has the problem, mm. and you should never take the blame yeah. and think that you never you never provided, mm. you never had, uh, you you don't know the styles, mm. you never satisfied. No, mm. she should speak and say because she has something that is it's in her mind, mm -hmm. and in reality, it is not true. Mm. Because even when you ask her after having sex with that man and that woman, uh, what do you feel? I feel very guilty. So mm. what yeah. Is that? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, and I think also yeah. so like, one thing that you uh -huh. said, you mm. said that when you own up your mistake, yes, you, that is the beginning of healing. Yeah. Yes. and I think I've seen that in most. Even in our life as a couple, mm. anytime he, there is a mistake and a person willingly owns up, mm. the person never repeats the mistake. One, secondly, the person who is uh, offended gets to understand the other person Better. easier mm. because mm. now you are at a place of I think you you are empathizing with the person, yes. and also you are trying to understand them. In the you know there is no way somebody can come to you broken and telling this is where I found myself, and then you say ah unless you are a mad person, <laughs> yes. but a person who is sane. Yeah. Even if you are an unbeliever, you will 
tend to settle, mm -hmm. calm down, and how did it go? And that is the beginning of healing. Yeah, and, and then you know, I want to say something. I want to uh, strengthen on what Beryl has said. Mm -hmm. Yes. Any time also we have a misunderstanding with Pastor, mm -hmm. yes. and he he corrects me. Yes. And I'm quiet. Yes. You find even that thing doesn't go many minutes. It doesn't go. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I think my wife, what you said, what you did was not right mm -hmm. because I felt this and this. Mm -hmm. The minute I accept, mm -hmm. there's it no other it debate. It doesn't escalate. We find we solve that thing within less than ten minutes. Mm -hmm. But if I start now, even you, even another, can I also remind you another time? Also? <laughs> 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 now you bring down that he did last year and you are Ukumu and Biyo. And I think also yeah, with infidelity. Now we bring so, but when, when you issues. accept, mm. in fact, you solve that thing within less than five within, minutes. And, and like, many people, mm -hmm. I've had friends, yeah. even I have a friend I was sharing with the, yeah. about, I share much with the, him because yes. sometimes we pray over the issues. Yes. There are infidelity that happened, mm. but when the husband confessed, they never resurfaced. I think this thing of Nen that you are talking about, <laughs> that day I was talking to the Clinton, I was telling him that I think who we are right now yes. is actually what we were when we were still young. Yes. What we were when we were still children, it, it's models who we become. Because this thing of Nasamati denying, mm -hmm. like uh, your parent comes with a kibogo and tells you, come here. Who did this? You say, I don't know. You say, if you accept, I'll forgive you. Mm. But if you lie to me, 20 canes mm. and then say actually it was me who didn't say okay go and down. they still can you now i was going you 20 but i'll give you now five so your father came to you five instead it of 20. Be so. so anytime you do a mistake and then you own it up yes. you must get something mm. but if only they will be telling us that if you tell me the truth i'll not punish you mm. and then he tells you it's me then it's okay because you're the truth go away mm. it will have helped us to be speaking the truth than being defensive so even when we come in our marriages now we are fearing that if i accept what will she do? Mm. So I have to defend myself because there is a punishment awaiting me. Though she not kill me, but I know I've been wired up not that after accepting a mistake, there is a kakiboho coming. Thank you. But and I, then another thing also, mm, mm, the, and this is a serious, serious problem. Mm, I think everyone is a victim of this. Mm, I don't know who is going to shout it to us. I don't know whether it can be shouted or softly <laughs> spoken. Are you aware? <laughs> that when someone accepts a mystic, mm. that is the strongest human being yes. in this world. Mm. Wow. Accepting, mm. that is the strongest human, what would I say, even not human, a husband and a wife. Yes. And should That's be the pardoned. Strongest. They are not mm. weak. Mm. They shouldn't mm. be blamed. They are blamed. the strongest. Wow. Mm. You are getting that, because wow. immediately they accept, as we have said, mm. your mind and your heart will give you capacity never to go that way again. Yeah. Amen. But this person yeah. who is denying and giving excuses and trying person. to defend himself, mm. he is the person who is very, very, very weak. Mm -hmm. mm. You get the point? Mm. And this is the person who is rightly to, come, to keep on reoccurring this issue. And living on survival. Mm. That is survival mm. system. Mm. You get the point? So and it's a negative and a demonic way of survival. Yeah. So when I accept, mm. I am the strongest. strongest. Mm. When I speak That's the truth, wife. I am the strongest. I'm mm. the strongest wife. I am the strongest husband. Mm. You are not weak. Mm. And you see, this person who is strongest also speaks very few words. Mm -hmm. You see? Mm -hmm. He speaks few words. You mean Guinea Bay, and you want a Macare Mingi, Giacona, Diana, and Gamma Bob Kuba, and so he looks like he's biggest mm -hmm. in the physical, mm -hmm. but in the reality, he's the it's smallest. The, smallest. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. the one who talks so much, <laughs> <laughs> the one who is talking so much, yes. and exaggerating, uh -huh. and showing how, how, yes. how the problem is, uh, is, uh, is, big, uh, is big, uh, you know, showing the, the, the yeah. enormous, showing how it was. <laughs> this is not something that should never happen. Yes. This one is the one who is weak. Mm -hmm. The one who says, I am sorry, it is true what you have said. Mm -hmm. And, and then the more you say sorry, then he, he ends up on top. Even another, he begins again. <laughs> this one is the one who is small. Mm -hmm. The one who is trying to explain and exaggerate yeah. is the one who is small. The one who is saying two, three words, mm -hmm. I am sorry, I accept. And I'm sorry, and I'm not. And if they are genuinely sorry, the they person. should be forgiven. Mm. But now, unfortunately, mm. we, yes. we think this person who is very loud, who is able to explain very well, mm. is the strongest. No. Mm. And so, in marriage, mm. it, it is not what your partner has done. Mm. You get to the point. Mm. You, no matter what they have done, mm. no matter what they have said, mm. it is possible to heal, though it is a process. Yeah. Mm. But the challenge is, mm. most of us suffer with unforgiveness. Mm. Yes, unforgiveness. So you can 
cannot you cannot heal without forgiving without people. forgiveness mm. you know mm. and forgiveness does not does not mean that you must forget mm -hmm. no mm. the mind sometimes may keep that memory but the pain is lifted up yes yeah. because now this person has accepted mm. what are you going to do now will you continue now pinning them down every day you did this you did mm -hmm. this that one doesn't work yeah because mm. you're also giving I think them if somebody has, has, mm. has really repented yeah, you're giving you're condemning them mm. and you're making them feel like that is their position mm. Mm. Mm -hmm. You're getting that. Yeah. The more I keep on repeating something, for example, if Pastor Monene has gone out of the management mm -hmm. and he has come and confessed to my wife, I'm sorry mm -hmm. for what I did. I think I was tempted uh, for whatever reason. He, and he, of course, I also retaliate after that. It's not going to be soft as we are speaking. Mm -hmm. But mm -hmm. if he has confessed, anytime I see him with the berry, I'm going to be, I hope I'm going to be You know, now. <laughs> <laughs> you know now me, I don't even trust you. Mm. You know I don't even trust you. Because you since the day when you had, uh, you had sex with Eunice, even now mm. I still feel like you can have it. Now you are the one who is who is having a problem. Who is having a problem, mm. not yeah. your partner. You should let go. I I, I think what you've said number one. Mm. If I'm the one who was offended, she comes to me and that by that I did this thing mm. uh, with this person and it happened. Mm. The first thing I should do, if she, when she asks for forgiveness, she'll I've forgiven you. Yes. Then we begin now discussing that the thing from a point of forgiving. Thank you. Yeah. Yes. Mm. Not that, no, 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 wait for us. Who was he? What happened? I condemn, and then after she has uh, cried, she has gone on the floor. It's when I say, mm, I'll think about it. Mm, mm -mm. I think we should begin from the point of, like Jesus said, tell, told this woman, neither do I condemn you. Alianzi mm -hmm. Yakabe now, go and sin no more. Yeah. She's telling you, now you've sinned. Mm -hmm. This was bad. You said with the man, now I'm forgiving you. No, mm -hmm. she began with. And for the, a person to come to you and repent and mm -hmm. confess their sins, it means one thing. Yeah. They are vulnerable enough to trust you. Yeah. Yes. Secondly, yeah. They are good mm. people because cheats don't confess, they don't hardly cheats don't confess. Hardly. So, I think one thing they though you will grieve for a while, mm. these people deserve forgiveness. Yes. Mm. Another thing that mm. it's it deserve it, it has built, rebuilt certain trust. Mm. There is a certain level of intimacy that both of you mm. will have because Sasa, this is a vulnerable part of this person. Yeah. Mm. I'm a and trust now, but Sasa, like, well, like even that part, you cannot handle it. Then that is immaturity. Mm. So, and I think so. Solution for infidelity one mm. is yes. forgive this person and continue living together, mm. yeah. or to divorce this person and never marry until this person is dead. And also, don't defend Thank the you. issue. That's what you said last time. Yes. Yes. I divorce you and I never marry until the day you will die. Natural yes. death. And on the side of <laughs> offender, it is good to own up the mistake. Yeah. One of the things that I think, uh, and you have said it as the second thing, eh? mm. that uh, you know, uh, spouses, uh, married people, mm. husbands and wife, mm. need to be probably taught, eh? mm. is talking so much about teaching, eh? yeah. it, it is about, I think, dealing with anchor issues. Mm. Mm. Because anchor will surely come. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> Issues will surely come. Mm. But I think uh, most of the men and the women, mm -hmm. they don't know how to handle. They don't know, Pastor. Mm. Moment of anger. <laughs> <laughs> Moment. Kaende, <laughs> kaende. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And the one that Jesus said mm. that offenses will surely come. come. Mm. It could be offenses brought because of infidelity, mm. like we are saying here today. Mm. Yes. Or any other, it can be about finances, yes. it can be about in-laws, uh -huh. mm -hmm. it can be about children, mm. yes. it can even be about what you cooked. <laughs> I love eating Ugali, you cooked pilau. <laughs> and that is the tag of one until somebody you, you yes. have been made me banana. I saw a man who killed the wife. Uh -huh. You know, From a woman who had four children, but yes. her husband killed her because she he had said in the evening mm. he wants to find Ugali. Mm. Imagine he came and took a knife mm -hmm. and murdered that, that woman. Is that. But you see, that murder is not about today. Mm. It is piled up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And that's why you find most of the times when there is infidelity in marriage, mm. you may not be able to solve the two of you. Mm. You need a neutral person who can come here mm -hmm. and who is not biased, who is not going to side with your wife or your husband, mm. but be able to show you mm. how to heal. You really can't, you're not so bad at that time because you feel betrayed, you feel the trust has mm. been broken. Mm. So when you have someone who is neutral, who comes in between and now begins to break, fragment this issue mm. into small bits, you're able to take it up. Mm. Because 
I'm, I'm able to express my attitude mm. through words and they're able to judge me and vice versa mm. and look for a for a mutual ground you get that mm. eh? so when there is infidelity kindly don't deal with it with the two of you mm. you need a neutral person who is a mentor mm. because at that time you're not reasoning right both of you mm. feel entitled entitled that why would you do this i'm entitled to you entitled to me mm. so that entitlement is what brings this volatile feelings and emotions are so high yeah. such that you're not able to agree and so you need someone who can walk the journey and it's not one day mm-hmm. because those emotions will keep on coming because it leaves a memory of pain in your hearts and mm-hmm. in your mind mm-hmm. so you need a third party you need a third party no matter how strong you are mm-hmm. you need another person to walk mm-hmm. the journey with you mm-hmm. and it can be months it can be weeks mm-hmm. but at the end of the day people are able to heal out of it mm-hmm. so uh, people can heal from um Uh, from infidelity mm. yeah. and there are people who don't heal from that because mm. of feeling uh, they are they are mrs Ra- righteous and mr righteous self righteousness uh, self righteousness mm. and you feel i can't i can't forgive another person even the word of god says mm-hmm. even you cannot forgive mm. your brother mm. god wants to never forgive you mm. so for the gift should also forgive forgiveness us, yeah, has caused so many marriages to break to stagnate mm. yeah and then keeping on reminding someone about mm. their past mm. and also this person you are reminding about their past they also beat about that past mm. so it's like you are worsening the situation yeah yeah yeah, yeah. and we feel like we by so doing you feel so good when you see that person down emotionally you see them down in their moods that's what pleases you that means now you have changed to become an assistant wife mm-hmm. and an assistant husband mm-hmm. because why should i be happy mm-hmm. when i see him when i remind him about his painful past mm-hmm. painful past mm-hmm. when i see him when i remind him about his painful past and i'm happy when he's down mm. and vice versa mm. then it means my mind has really changed pain yeah. has changed yeah pain has mm. changed me mm. to a different wife and to a different husband mm. any mistake any mistake in marriage regardless of the magnitude be it mm. infidelity mm. because me i can say after 13 years of, of of marriage we've been at a point whereby you have to forgive one another mm. but one thing that i've realized mm. is that you don't take anything so personal mm-hmm. sometimes you know it's because we take it so personal it's about me i mean if i near ev i mm. have to deal it with it like this but sometimes some things you begin to look at the bigger picture maybe that person there is the source of that thing there is a healing there is a problem with the person or there was a problem in the marriage at that point mm. that created that vulnerability mm. so i think people should get out of this self-centered space where people are so entitled and they take issues so personal mm. i had the other day a lady saying that me if the moment i just realize my husband or my boyfriend chats with another lady flirting that is it but i think that is just <laughs> being on a fi- talking living on finality mm. you know life shouldn't be like you have to it is either black or white mm. nothing in between there can be a disagreement there can be so, uh, yes. compromises yeah. so we need to make people understand that if some certain things happens you don't take it so personally 